Okay, so I wrote something um, because of everything that's coming to light and everything going on in the world. And this is what I have to say. Now, these are my own personal thoughts and opinions. Um, yeah, here we go. As a child, I was told America was the best country where you are free. You can finally be. What they didn't tell you is it comes with a cost. Gaslit your whole life. As your eyes start to open, you start to see America's flaws. You see what freedoms we are told we have um, slowly are being ripped from us. My freedom isn't really free. It's based off, based on contingency. To be a woman in America means you have to give up the rights to your body and your brain. But you are to sit back and let the man show you through his eyes. Why can't I use my own eyes? Because then you will see the truth in lies this country was founded on. You will see racism blooming like a flower. You will see racism blooming like a flower in the spring. You will see hate spreading before your very eyes like butter on bread. America isn't free. It comes with a cost. Just to be alive in America means you can't be yourself. You have to be what they say you can be. If you are a part of a group, i.e. LGBTQIA, well that will not stand in America's eyes. If you are of a different race other than white, that will not stand in America's eyes. Tell me again, why is America the best country? From what I can see, America and its unjust people of power will let you know if you are free. Cops took an oath to protect its citizens. Instead, they put away innocent men and women, let the bad guys go, and murder for sport. I get it everyone is not the same then explain why our protectors turn a blind eye to evil acts being committed based on the color of our skin the love in our hearts and shut down and shut down our voices so we cannot be heard no america is not the best country you know that song i am proud to be an american i tweaked the lyrics to match the current year i'm embarrassed to be an american you shove your morals down our throats dictate my I'm sorry, our every move, lie to us, and then turn on the old gaslit chambers and paint me a sugar-coated lie. I'm not living the American dream. I'm living the American nightmare, a place where we get, we get acquainted with fear and let it reside inside of us. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the place we call home. Again, those are just my, my thoughts and opinions I just wanted to share.